We are at the Osceola County Stadium Complex where the Houston Astros hold their spring training today playing against the St. Louis Cardinals. That's going on in the background, but right here is Hooks President Ken Schramm. As we always do during spring training, we bring down a group of media and, and local folks to, to experience spring training. And Ken, for you, having played in the big leagues for as long as you did and having been involved in baseball as a player, for as long as you were. Spring training always brings back great memories. Oh man, it's always fun to come to spring training. I don't care. I'll, I want to do this until the day <laughs> they put me in the coffin. But uh, yeah, it's just a, a lot of fun. You see people that you haven't seen in a long time and you, you, re, you, you renew friendships. And right. uh, you know, the, the Astros folks are, are so nice to us. They treat us uh, with uh, well, just like friends right. and uh, it's awesome. And we had an opportunity today. It wasn't arranged, but we just had an opportunity, a chance meeting with owner Jim Crane, and that was kind of nice. You know what? He is a class act. Um, he invited me to play his golf course at the Floridian, which is about 100 miles south of here, and I am going to take him up on that <laughs> offer. I'll tell you that. <laughs> was I invited? I think there's only room for a couple of oh, us. Oh, okay. Of course, Reed and Reese are, are probably, probably going to take those probably spots. Invited okay. And, they they don't know. have a five some five some no, in golf, do they? No, they it's don't only let a five. Yeah. Sorry, okay. but you know, one thing that uh, changing uh, and getting back on track here, uh, one thing that I think uh, for Hooks fans this season that you can be excited about, and and we had heard about this before, and we talked to them, but coming down here to spring training and watching them interact with the players, our coaching staff is really excited about this season. Our new, our new manager, Keith Bodie, who of course was a hitting coach for us back in 2009. But then we've had the opportunity to interact some with Gary Ruby, our new pitching coach, and Joel Chimelis, our new hitting coach. And these guys can't wait to get started. You know what, they they think we've got an opportunity to have a great club. And uh, you know, I, I, and I believe Keith. I mean, he's been in this game a long time. He's been in the Texas League for a number of years, although he hasn't been the last couple. but. He knows what it takes to win in the Texas League, and he seems to think that we're going to be pretty good. Mm -hmm. Now, last year we were managed by Tom Lawless, and even though he's not our manager this year, he's still in the system. He'll be the roving infield instructor throughout the minor leagues for Houston, and we've had the opportunity to catch up with him and his family as well. Yeah, he came in and ate our hamburgers. <laughs> you know, it's all just like him, come in and find a free meal. No, Tom, he's, he's such a good friend. We, we had so much fun last year, and of course, he's already planning the uh, the days that he's coming to Corpus, and he's he wants me to set golf up. All right. So he he wants to get in my pocket, and he usually okay. does. So all right, very good. That'll be fun. Very good. Now, one of the things that always happens at spring training, regardless of who we see the minor leaguers play or who the Astros are playing, you always bump into somebody you know from somewhere in your baseball past. Does that happen to you here in the last two days, it, Ken Trump? Yes, it has. In fact, I'm, I'm talking to Dave Clark, our manager who is now, he was our manager for the first two or three, three years. years right. and third base coach uh, Third base coach for the Astros. Uh, that's, I'm talking to Dave. And out of the blue, guy comes walking over and he goes, Shrami? What are you doing? I thought you were, you're not in El Paso anymore. I go, no, no, I've been in Corpus the last eight and a half, nine years. Anyway, it's Ed Hodge. He was a left-handed pitcher. Uh, we played together in Minnesota. I find out he's the he's the BP pitcher for the Astros. On the about that. And travels with him. Throws, about that. Throws batting practice. Well, I had to tease him a little bit. I said, bud, you threw BP in the big leagues when you were pitching, so you should be good at that. You, anyway. you never know who you're going to bump no. into at spring training. This morning we're over at the minor league complex, and of course the Cardinals are playing here right now. And as is the custom, the visiting club will get here two, three hours in advance, and the hitters are going to want to hit. So some of the Cardinals hitters came over to the minor league batting cages, and Mark McGuire kind of sauntered on over there as well. Big Mark. Big Mark. Yeah, he... He took me deep a couple times. I, I, I didn't want to talk to him. <laughs> but he still looks like he can hit it. I bet he can. Yeah. He's, uh, well, he's done a great job with these guys. I mean, my gosh, they won a World Series last year. And while well, he's uh, the hitting coach and just he's uh, he's got a lot of knowledge and I think he's really it's, he's rubbed off on these guys. Well, coming down here to spring training, we're pumped up for the start of the season, which of course for the Hooks is April the 5th. But prior to that, the Houston Astros, as they wind up their spring training, will play the Hooks at Whataburger Field on Monday. Day, April the 2nd. Now, Ken, I know we've sold a lot of tickets, but I think there's still some left. Very few. Uh -huh. um, in fact, I, I visited with Brian Mayhood uh, on our way down here, and he said we've got three or four hundred left, and that uh, those will be gone uh, 
in a few days. So that's a, that's a good thing. So here we are, spring training. Baseball season is here. The start of the eighth season of Hooks Baseball right around the corner. Hooks President Ken Schramm bringing down a host of people, and we're just having a great deal of fun here in Kissimmee. Ken, thanks so much for everything. Always fun. Good to see you guys. All righty.